much. And as he mentioned, that storm ripped through Salisbury. Our crews were there to capture the damage that it left in its wake. Now you saw the video at the top of the show from near the university, but that damage was only the tip of the iceberg. In that area, several other cars were flipped over and at least one building was permanently destroyed. I spoke with one eyewitness who said as she saw what she believed to be a tornado coming right at her, she almost couldn't believe what she was seeing. He just yells, bell and run, and we ran to the back and booked it. Employees in this shopping center were still in shock after what appeared to be a That's tornado like ripped through the area. Fallon Rice and her co-workers at Cricket Wireless hiding in an inventory closet to stay safe. And the walls were shaking and it sounded like it was going to bring the whole thing up. There's plaster and everything, dust falling from the walls. So we were pretty surprised the windows were still here. Um, still didn't expect to see other cars on top of my car in the parking lot. Aaron Moore, Rice's co-worker, saw the storm coming. Uh, first thing I saw, a trash can flying across the uh, parking lot over there, guy chasing after it. Then I see the you know, wind start picking up, the trees start pulling down to the ground, and I was like, that's a tornado, found, run to the back. But like, didn't really have time to react, just had to get back. What are you thinking while this is happening? Maybe I'm about to die, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Who knows what's going on, you know? Asia Pitts was on her way to winging it to meet her boyfriend for their regular Monday date when she felt her car begin to shake from the wind. I seen like a tornado kind of come. I could see the wind in the trees just coming, just coming. So I was just like, I hope he's okay. And then my phone rung and I looked at my phone and it was him and he was like, I just flipped, like the car just flipped, but I'm okay. But my foot is all cut up, but I got out of the car in time for it, you know, not to flip on top of me. So I was just, it's a lot. Like I'm really frustrated. It's just too much. Her boyfriend, Walter Anderson, was okay, only sustaining minor injuries. Looking at the security footage from Hoppers, though, you can see on screen what happened to him while he was in the car. The whole storm only lasted 30 seconds, but the footage of the immediate aftermath flipped cars, destroyed buildings, and just overall debris is something that people will remember for a lifetime. Not a day you're going to soon forget. Definitely not. Definitely not. I'm framing this. <laughs> Julian Sidor. 47 ABC.